Magandang araw po, Leo. Welcome po sa Star Tarot. I hope you are doing well. Ito po ang inyong intuitive tarot reading for the week of July 25 to August 1st. Please keep in mind po na ang reading na ito ay for the collective so maaaring mag-resonate sa inyo at maaaring hindi. Kung hindi po totally mag-resonate sa inyo, you may consider watching your moon, your rising, and your Venus signs at baka nandoon ang mensahe na para sa inyo. So just please take what resonates with your situation and leave what doesn't for someone else thank you so let's call in your angels and your spirit guides to assist us throughout this reading thank you okay so leo kuha muna tayo ng oracle cards and we're going to look into the messages guidance inspiration insights that are coming through for you for the week of july 25 to august 1st oh my god <laughs> So, very energetic <laughs> ang inyong mga cards nagliliparan ang mga uh, cards ninyo today is very chatty hey? so ang unang card is energy and sinasabi dito life force is flowing open yourself to receive the power from within wow you're so energetic tulad ng mga cards ninyo ngayon tumatalon so Leo, punong puno ka ng energy punong puno ka ng drive punong puno ka ng determination punong puno ka ng focus is what's coming through uh, sa, sa card na ito um, ngayong week so napakagandang energy para ipagpatuloy mo ang iyong mga ginagawa, ipagpatuloy mo yung mga proyekto mo, mga ideas mo, mga uh, gusto mong mga bagay na ma-accomplish. Now is the perfect time para ipursu mo yan. Now is the time na dumiskarte ka para maabot mo ang mga gusto mong makamit uh, ngayong week. Very, very beautiful full of energy si Leo so your next card is reconciliation remember the source of love a loving action is all you need to begin the process reach out with a simple first step so ang napipick up ko dito right off the bat Leo is reconciliation with your mom I feel na ang iba sa inyo ay merong rift between a family member. And in this particular energy, ang napipick up ko is maaring ang iba sa inyo ay merong misunderstanding or merong uh, communication gap with your mom. So, um, now is the time though na magre-reconcile ka. Yung tinatawagan ka ngayon ng spirit na ito na yung panahon para magpakumbaba ka, makipagbati ka sa iyong mom kung yun man ang yung ka, uh, ka-misunderstanding o makipagbati ka sa mga tao na na nakagalit mo or, or uh, meron kang misunderstanding with. And yun, now is the perfect time to do that. Uh, pairalin mo yung pag-ibig, yung pagmamahal sa iyong puso, uh, sa iyong isip. Hayaan mo na ang, ang pag-ibig, ang mawayani sa iyong puso ngayong week. Hayaan mo na mag-flow ang love sa iyong buhay ngayon darating na week. And when you feel love, ang gaan lang. Ang gaan lang ng pakiramdam. Ang gaan lang ng iyong pag-iisip. And forgiveness will come out kapag ang nararamdaman natin ay pagmamahal, ay pag-ibig. For some of you, merong reconciliation na mangyayari in the week ahead. So, yung next card ninyo ay expectation. Be open to whatever comes next. It might just be the music your heart's been waiting to hear. Oo, ang ganda. Oh. Di ang nararamdaman ko dito. Meron kang ini-expect sa buhay, meron kang minimithi sa buhay na maari mong uh, matanggap ngayon darating na week. So, yung kung ano man tong ini-expect mo, allow yourself to to feel na you are deserving to receive that. First thing na dapat mong isipin is you are deserving to receive that. You are deserving to 
to experience whatever that is na, na gusto mong makamit sa buhay na, na ini-expect mong mangyari sa buhay mo so ayun beautiful beautiful sign so your next card is mercy let compassion fill your world offer kindness to all living things what you give you also receive oh speaking of uh, pagre-receive dito sinabi ko sa expectation na you are going to receive something na maaring ine-expect mo nga or maaring pinagpipray mo yan and yeah with the mercy card if i'm getting the energy of uh, giving and receiving dito so kung ano man tong ine-expect mo na maaring dumating sa yo in the week ahead definitely meron na talagang blessing na nadadating in in whatever form that is uh, because siyempre iba-iba kayo so iba-ibang bagay ang inyong ini-expect na makuha o dumating sa buhay ninyo. So, with love um, energy dito na flowing through you, sinasabi din dito sa card na allow then the compassion to fill your world. Allow the love and compassion to fill your life ngayong week. So, punong-puno kayo na pagmamahal ng pag-ibig towards others. Uh, ngayong darating na week, Leo, you are going to be generous with your love and compassion ngayong week towards others. So that is very, very nice. Very, very beautiful energy coming through for you. So tignan natin kung anong masasabi ng tarot cards for you for the coming week for Leo, July 25 to August 1st. Okay, your first card is Three of Pentacles. Napakaganda. Uh, three of Pentacles is the beginning of success, Leo. So, maaring yung success na yan ang, ang something na hinihintay mo, na pinagpipray mo. Maybe you are expecting your projects. Maybe you are expecting your, your contract, your career to be successful so maaring isa sa mga area ng buhay ninyo or even more kung ano man yung pinagpupukusan mo during this period is going to soar high kumbaga uh, aangat na siya ngayon manunotice na siya ng lahat ng mga tao manunotice na siya ng public manunotice siya ng iyong mga bosses, ng iyong mga colleagues, and you are going to be highlighted. Yung trabaho mo at ikaw will be recognized by the people around you. Mahal nga ang iba sa inyo, yung trabaho ninyo, hindi napapansin before, hindi, hindi siya nanonotice ng mga tao sa paligid mo before, lalong-lalo na ang inyong management team. But this time, Expect that your work is going to be noticed. Expect that your work is going to be rewarded this time. Your effort, your energy, your heart that you put into it is going to be rewarded and recognized. Ang iba sa inyo, alam mo, ito yung simula ng pagsipa ng iyong karir. Ito yung simula ng pagsipa ng iyong mga uh, proyekto. Uh, meron na akong meron na akong napipick up na basa inyo maybe is on social media yung naghihintay kayo pinagpipray ninyo ine-expect ninyo na magmo-monetize ang inyong uh, social media platform yung yung FB page or your IG or yung yung YouTube channel S some of you yun ang ine-expect nyo na umangat, na sumipa, na, na mapansin na ng, ng madaming tao. And yung, yung expectation mo na yon is going to be realized. Kasi this week might be the start o na manunotice mo din na tinatangkilik na siya ng mga tao. Na you are going to get more subscribers, you are getting more followers, Alam mo yun. So, good luck to you, Leo. This is a very good sign because this is this is the beginning of success, you know. 
Ah, uh, eto ni magdadala sa iyo yung success na to is going to lead you towards a financial abundance. Even ang iba sa inyo is going to receive promotion is what's coming through here. So, pag-igihan mo lang yung trabaho mo, continue to persevere and continue to uh, put your heart and soul into what you do para alam mo yo when the universe sees that and the universe will will help you out na maging successful kajaan sa iyong endeavor. So, okay, tignan natin what else for Leo. What else for Leo for July 25 to August 1st. Okay. So we have another 3. Wow. So 3 of swords. 3 of swords. So we have the master number 33, napaka-powerful na number. So I would suggest Leo to you to look up for the meaning of master number 33 kasi dalawa na yung three natin dito uh, for more guidance all right and three maybe is a significant number for some of you and if if that is so then i'm pretty sure that there is a special message for you here in this reading so three of swords this is there is heartache there is with uh betrayal maybe for some of you here and i feel kung ano man to, whatever this represents for you leo this is fresh this is still fresh yung sakit fresh pa to sa iyo kung ano man ito um three of swords na to sa inyo masakit pa very fresh pa ang pangyayaring ito I feel since magkakabit ito dito sa reconciliation, maybe meron kang nakasagutan, uh, maaring meron kayong hindi pagkakaintindihan. And because what I was getting here is, this is a mom and the kids relationship na merong problema dito, na merong hindi pagkakaintindihan. So that's why it hurts a lot. Kasi syempre, it's very... Uh, normal na pag yung kamag-anak mo lalong lalo na yung parents mo ang naka no, yun, yung wala ka yung pagkakaintindihan at some point masakit talaga yun it, it's really affecting to your core heavy yan kapag ang magulang yung walang pagkakaintindihan so I feel for some of you of course this will not resonate with everyone okay doon sa mga taong Itong mensahe resonates with you na meron kayong rift ng nanay mo, ng mami mo, ng mother mo. It's really, really painful. And ngayon, kung ano man to, this is going to change. Kasi, I feel na nag-uusap kayo dito. Meron, me, nag, kahit nagka-misunderstanding kayo, meron pa rin kayong pag-uusap na nagaganap between the two of you. Yung napipick up ko is nag-uusap kayo because one of you are trying to patch up the rift. Subalit, nag, yung parang nag i pa rin yung inyong mga damdamin. One of you nag i pa rin ang inyong damdamin. Yung parang imbis na magkaayos kayo ang nangyayari, lalo ulit kayong nag-aaway, lalo ulit kayong um, nare-refresh yung kung ano man yung uh, root ng inyong hindi pagkakaintindihan. So, but since we have a reconciliation card here na nakakabit dito sa Three of Swords, I feel that for most of you, Leo, na merong ganitong sitwasyon, that is going to um, come to an end in the week ahead. Meron na kayong magkakaroon kayo ng malinaw na pag-uusap. Merong mga pagkakataon na mag-uusap kayo and you are going to patch up kung ano man yung pinagmulan ng inyong pag-aaway, ng inyong diskusyon. You know, kung ang hahayaan mo yung pag-ibig, yung pagmamahal sa iyong puso, sa iyong isipan, sa iyong buong pagkatao, ang hahayaan mong mamayani, forgiveness is going to to dissolve that pain o yung mga tampuhan o I mean yung tampo na naramdaman ninyo towards your mom so 
I feel that this is going to end to a beautiful reconciliation. Kung ano man tong sakit na naidulot uh, sa inyo ng, ng iyong magulang or ikaw yung nakasakit sa iyong magulang, that is going to patch up uh, ngayon week or perhaps ngayong week kayo magsisimula ng pag-uusap para kayo ay mag- makapag um, ayos na dalawa so that's beautiful okay so what else for Leo angels and spirit guides Leo please messages for Leo July 25 to August First, okay, so kunin natin, alright, so meron tayong dalawang card na tumalon, so we have the six of wands, so napakagandang energy, this is a triumphant uh, energy dito, so six of wands, so six of wands is a sweet victory, kasi pinaghirapan mo to, kung ano man tong trabaho mong pinaghirapan mo, is going to succeed finally. Kasi, di, parehas ng three of pentacles, kanina yung napipick up ko dyan, is dead malang ang mga tao sa paligid mo, lalong-lalo na ang iyong mga boss. Doon sa tinatrabaho mo, doon sa pagtsatsaga mo, doon sa, sa sobrang uh, dedication mo sa trabaho, dead malang ang iyong mga boss. So, while this week, things are going to change sa'yo. Kasi, si mabibigyan pansin na yung mga effort mo na ginagawa mo, na binubuhos mo dyan sa trabaho mo. And that is your success. You're going to celebrate that. Kasi, after several years na nagtatrabaho ka, na binubuhos mo ang lahat-lahat dyan sa trabaho mo, hindi ka napapansin. And now, finally, di ba, magbubunga na ang iyong pinaghirapan. Makikita mo na ang fruit of your labor ngayon. So, that is a sweet victory for you, Leo. And congratulations, kasi merong perang papasok sa iyo dito. Maybe, ang iba sa inyo na merong uh, malaking proyekto, that will be rewarded. That will be financially rewarded. Sa tuwa ng mga boss mo, maybe meron ka ng ibang boss ngayon. You are still working on the same on the same company and the same department pero iba na ang boss mo. Bibigyan ka dito ng ng reward, bibigyan ka dito ng bonus, mabibigyan ka dito ng promotion, mabibigyan ka dito ng ng malaking exposure sa public na ma mararecognize ang trabaho mo and you're going to be financially rewarded so that's beautiful i'm also hearing na there is a um offer so maybe for some of you magkakaroon ka ng ng offer from other company maari ang iba ay interesado sa trabaho mo interesado sa iyo uh, maaring ipapirate ka ano ng ibang kumpanya or I feel also that maybe you are going to receive an offer uh, ng mas mataas na position or maybe this is the same position but higher um, salary maaring bibigyan ka ng increase uh, sa sweldo dito So, that's so beautiful. So, yung next card mo, nakasama ng six of wands na lumabas is another six. And this is the six of swords. So, yung six of swords, oh, hang on, Leo. We have synchronicity right here. We have six of wands and we have the six of swords. Tignan mo yung mga lumalabas na numbers is double-double. So, we have a uh, number 66 din dito. So, six may be so significant for some of you. Um... And then I would suggest also that you look up for the meaning of number 66 because there is a special message for you there. So, the Six of Swords is a moving on card. Tignan mo yung Six of Wands, papunta din doon, no? papunta ka sa iyong tagumpay talaga. You are going to embrace success here and alam mo kung saan ka na papunta you are moving forward you are moving towards a beautiful 
new beginning dahil maaaring magsisimula ka ng panibagong uh, posisyon sa trabaho, magsisimula ka ng panibagong proyekto, or maybe magsisimula ka ng, ng iyong trabaho na merong bagong uh, amount ng sweldo, ba? Diba? So that's so beautiful. And since... I was guided to put this card close to the Three of Swords. I feel that iiwanan mo na to. Definitely, maghihilom na ang iyong mga sugat sa iyong puso, Leo. You are living this heartbreak, this pain, this heartache. Um, at iyayakapin mo na lang ang buhay ng punong-puno ng pag-ibig at compassion at forgiveness. Kasi sa Six of Swords, this is a moving on card. This is the energy na iiwanan mo na kung ano man yung hindi nagsiserve ng buhay mo. Iiwanan mo na yung mga bagay, mga tao, pangyayari, sitwasyon that doesn't serve your uh, best interest. And I feel in this case, ito yun, yung sakit na dulot ng Three of Swords meron akong naririnig na betrayal. So, I feel for some of you uh, in the collective, nakaranas ng betrayal from your friend, from your partner, from your other family members, or maaring from your, your spouse. So, whatever that three of swords represents for you, Leo, you are moving on from that. You are going to choose love and you are going to choose compassion for yourself and you are going to choose forgiveness. Iiwanan mo na to because alam mo na walang magagawang maganda sa iyo yan, ang pakiramdam na yan. So you are moving on and you are going to start a new life. A new life na matahimik, a new life na wala nang galit sa puso mo kasi alam mo na wala namang mangyayari walang ika hindi ikakaganda ng buhay mo kung meron kang mga emotional baggages uh, sa yung puso so Leo that's all I have for you for the week I hope nakatulong ang reading na ito in some way please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you are new to my channel and if you are already part of my star tarot family thank you for supporting my channel i wish you have a blessed and wonderful day love and light